Hey everybody, this is Melissa. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm in Word and I'm going to show you how to use the Smart Lookup and Search function. What this allows us to do is to pick some text from within our Word document and do an online search for more information about that topic. So for example, let's say that I want to find more information about Smart Art Graphics in Word. I'm going to highlight that phrase, right click, and go to search and it's going to search for smart art graphics in word what we highlighted so it's going to bring up some searches for websites some stuff from office support and things like that but if we go to more and we go to web then it's going to narrow it down to websites about our topic so let's just say that we want to go to this one that says easy steps for creating smart art graphics if we click on the three buttons or the more actions and we tell it to open, then it's going to open that blog and it's, we can read that for more information. We can also within our document click on the more actions and we can insert a link to that document. Then our users can go into control and click to follow the link. We can also enter it as a citation which means it's going to put it the name in quotes, it's going to put the date, and it's going to give the link, which is also clickable. If we do this drop down and we go to pictures, then we have pictures and images that we can insert. If you notice, this says Creative Commons only, which means that you can use the image, but credit has to be given to whoever created that image. So let's just click on one and it inserts the image and then it gives credit to whoever created the image so it takes care of that for you if we go to help then this is all Microsoft Office support documents and if you'll notice when we clicked on the other link it took us to the website via I use Google Chrome, but if you're using Firefox or you're using Safari or whatever, it will take you to that link through there. However, if we do it through here and say we want to see this, we go to more actions, we open. It's going to open it in here because it's part of our help function within the application itself. And that's how we use the smart lookup and search function. If you found this tutorial helpful, please be sure to like it, subscribe to my channel, and get notified. And I'll be back tomorrow with another tutorial. Thanks so much for watching.